Good morning, adventurers. I uh, hope everyone's awake now. Sorry about the uh, first attempt at this stream. Um, I'm a blonde. I hit the button to the Xbox and shut it off. Um, so today's stream is going to be to discuss how to maximize um, <coughs> double currency. So currently in Neverwinter, we have a two times Storm King's Thunder currency. And what I like to do to fully maximize this is I like to use the legacy quest. So if you come to this woman here, week, she's going to give you three quests that you can pick up each week. Um, what I like to do so that I fully maximize legacy quests is I stack them. Um, so for example, let me go down and show you. You'll see that I have three of the Storm King's Thunder legacy quest. Um, the first one is going to be to do heroics, and then um, just killing enemies. So as we're doing heroics and also doing different quests, we're going to accomplish both of those things. And then this one here, you have to do five quests. Um, so let's go ahead. And we're gonna go ahead and go to the Sea of Moving Ice, which happens to be one of my favorite zones. I know that's very controversial because not everybody likes it, but I do. I think it's um, very calming and it's also it's just different because it's not your typical mode of transportation getting around zones um, most of the zones you can use your mounts whereas with sea of moving ice you're using a boat um, when you first come into the sea of moving ice you can pick up a boat for free from this guy over here um, <clears throat> and then ultimately over time you can level that boat up by like doing different quests and stuff um, there is a legendary boat that you can get um, and you can get those from the map in a bottle that you can get from fishing so let's go ahead and pick up our quest Ring of wind, the frost, the... I might already have a bunch Not of these because the um, I do that I stack quest Yep, looks like we have the rune set. So the one thing that you want to look at when you're looking at the quest <clears throat> um, for the legacy, for it to count, this little like head that's next to the quest, that's what you want to look for. Those mean that those will count. So let's see, we've got... Yes, I do have the rune stead. So we're going to go ahead and do that one first.
Good morning, Analia. How are you doing today? You ready for the new mod, sister? I'm so ready. I cannot even wait. Okay, so I've gone through this quest obviously a few times. The first time you come through at the end <clears throat> um, you can get a set of weapons. In the current state of the game, they are definitely not best in slot. Many, many mods ago they were, but you might want to evolve them if you're into transmutes. Um, we have a saying in my guild and alliance that um, fashion is the new end game. So. guy he wants to fight the door blocked my rules I will deal with this morning lady how are you ready for today's mod. Yeah, um, you know what, Analia, that's why, like, pretty much, I am such a hoarder, uh, if I went through all my characters and showed you, like, all the stuff that I have, um, I save everything, like, I save gear, I save weapons, um, and every mod that comes out, <clears throat> I go through and try to pick up all the quote-unquote endgame stuff, and I just stockpile it, because you never know when things are going to become viable again in this game. Kind of like the Mirage set, how everybody was recently using it. I just want to take a minute to coffee, pause here. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Am I the only one who thinks this looks like a giant? Coffee. Like I feel like she should be crafting me up something really cool. Coffee, 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 coffee. <laughs> yeah, you gotta have some coffee in the stream, right? Because, uh, that is life. You can find that one in the, um, sound alerts dashboard. Another locked door. One more. Come on, Martha. Open the door. So 
So, uh, as I was saying earlier about doing these quests, just in this runestead alone, we're already at 16% on defeating enemies. I find that coming into, like, these little mini dungeons that they give you in each zone, it really burns through those the most. I don't know if it's because, like, these enemies are supposed to be quote-unquote tougher. Mm-hmm. But this is a good way to start that little quest off. Get up this guy. Get some to you. Um, I saved mine under channel points, yeah. You can do it as a bit. Um, but, you know, like I said last night, I wanted to give my viewers the capability to burn some Lego loot on some really fun sounds. But Martha, get him! Get him! You stay there. I'm gonna come around the back side. Oh, I hit like a wet noodle. Look at this. He's laughing. laughing no more. So, the first time you run through this quest, this is where you would get those weapons. That little chest there. You don't get it any additional time coming through. But that's okay. So let's see where that put us at with that one quest for killing enemies. 23%. That's not too bad. We're going to go turn this into the giant Martha. The small folk must. Storval's rune creation is stopped from. I think a lot of people overlook doing Storm King's Thunder once they've completed it, but that is a huge mistake. Um, and especially when it's like double currency, because one of the trials that you can get loaded into a lot of times is um, Svarborg, and there's three chests in there. So to make those keys, you have to do quests, you have to do heroics, you have to do fishing. Um, so that's why I always save it for when there's like a double because then I just come in here crank it out I make tons of currency and then I have keys to last me a long time um, so let's move on to completing the rest of our quests in here let's see what heroics up landing party that's a pretty easy one raiding party I might need to enlist a DPS to come help me see if anybody's on Oh, there's tons of people on. In Avernus. But we'll go do landing party. That one's easy enough. I can do that on my own. For the big one, I'm going to need assistance. Uh, where am I going? Oh yeah, this is this one all the way up here. <laughs> oh, 
Chewie's doing a giveaway. I'm gonna guess. Put up my favorite number. Okay, that sounds good. See, look how pretty this zone is. I really honestly don't understand why people hate Sea of Moving Ice. And especially if you've got, like, <clears throat> the faster boat, it doesn't take you near as long to get around. Um, it doesn't bother me, so I haven't really, like, gone after the faster boat, because... I just really enjoy the scenery. I think it's pretty. I like what they've done. The northern lights. These guys are a little bit tough. Thankfully, I'm a tank. I can take a hit. Ah, he thought you were gonna run me over. Not today, sucker. Look at this. He's laughing at me. My little baby hits. Huh, who's laughing now? That's one. Let's go kill these guys next. Ow. Jerk. The trample in me. That's not nice. Second, Chewie. I'm gonna guess again. How about number Dude, quit running me over, jerk face. There we go. Now people are starting to guess. Well, let's 
let's not stand on that rune. What? No, you can't guess like that, dude. What's wrong with you? Hello, motherfucker. <laughs> What's up, Rubix? How you doing this morning? <laughs> Thank you for the bits. I figured you were going to take the opportunity to come in here and spam me like I do you. <laughs> <laughs> what? What the fuck? What the fuck is right? Yeah, see me getting my butt handed here. I got some muscle on the way, though. I mean, to be I fair, I don't know the place, but the really fishy hurry. on me. Got a lot to be, but the fishy on me. Got a do, I'll slap your knee. Fishy on me, fishy on me. I don't know the place, but the fishy on me. Got a lot to be, but I'll slap your knee. Fishy to be, but I don't know ye. Fishy on me, it's a fishy to be. I love place, that one. Thank you, Emily, for those the bee, bits. But the fishy on me. Got a new, I'll slap your knee. Fishy on me, fishy on me. I don't want the place, but the fishy on me. Got a lot to be, but I'll slap your knee. Fishy to be, but I don't know ye. Fishy on me, it's a fishy to be. Come on, big boy. Oh! Get in there. And how can you expect to get good if you can't even make your bed? It's like... Get good, scrub. Okay, that was just mildly painful. Raiding party. Um, I'm gonna wait until the turtle one pops up because I like that one. Yeah, sorry, you missed it. <clears throat> Blessings. Uh, and I'm not doing Fishing Frenzy either. That one's so obnoxious. Uh, let's see what else we've got. Jawbreakers, Rune Trolls, Lost at Sea. Those are easy enough. Bone Collector. Totems. Okay. So I'm going to do the ships real quick. Did I just make friends? No, but I need to. <laughs> nice. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> Thank you, Rubix, for the bits. Oh no. She's like, yeah, Lego. I've been waiting a long time to troll your ass. <laughs> uh. It's okay, my friend. I know I know when you're streaming next. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Come on. Hi dwarf, how are you? Uh, let's pick another number for Chewy. Earth through 50, let's try. My favorite driver's number, 24, old Jeff Gordon. See where we're at with <clears throat> killing enemies here. 37%. Yeah. See, like I said, going into um, the Ruin Stod really, like, burns through a lot of those enemy points. Thank you, Rubix, for the four bits. this guy. Take a bitties. Let's try a number for Chewy. How about five? Mashing these guys. All right, just need one more of those. <laughs> oh, yeah, chicken dance.
the chicken dance? Yeah, it's good stuff. I need to destroy ice hunter totems here and collect dragon bone silver so it's like double duty right here holy smokes only is there like nine of you thank you door for the two bits Alright, so the Bone Collector is done. Oh, let's see if this guy needs the totem. Oh, it's already gone. He must have got it. <clears throat> There's five of you, huh? I like to be a polite adventurer. If I see people, like, smashing enemies around, you know, like, a certain quest, I try not to, you know, run in and kill whatever it is that they were after. Find that rude. Alright, I need three more totems. I still need moving eyes. Still need to kill rune change trolls. Naughty. And I need one more ship. Oh look, friends. Naughty. I don't know if there's any of those trolls on here. I think there might be. I think I have to go north. Fishing frenzy still up. Gross. <laughs> ah, Rubik's. I meant to tell you, um, your guy that did your graphics. Yep, I hired him the other night. <laughs> I finally gave up. I had spent more than enough time trying to do like all my graphics on my own um, and like what really tipped the scales was um, I had gone into one program to create like my um, overlay for my starting screen and it wanted me to have a logo 
Well, I didn't have a logo, so I went down the rabbit hole, started making my logo. Two hours later, and like it said, click here to download your logo that you've created. I'm like, okay, fair enough. Click on the button. Didn't realize that it was like opening it instead of saving it, and it was a zip file. So I ended up with like 200 web pages open. I was so pissed. I'm like, that's it. So I reached out to Amin. I'm like, please save me. I cannot do this madness anymore. Yep. So um, I should probably hear something from him. I would guess today because I think it was on Sunday night that I reached out to him. I'm like super excited. He's really, really lovely. Like... You guys, if you're getting into streaming and you need someone to help you with your graphics, like, go look at a Rubik's page. His guy did, like, all that work for him. And, I mean, it's just, it's beautifully done. Absolutely beautifully done. Yes, I did. Yep. Oh, get off me, big dick. Yeah, he's really nice. Like, um, I'm just, I'm so looking forward to seeing what he came up for me, you know? Alright, let's see where we're at. Uh, oh good, someone started Fishing Frenzy. They're never going to be able to complete it. Um, that's one thing about that heroic, you guys. Um, <clears throat> you have to have, like, 600 fish but the majority of the ones that you're going to catch are the ones that give you like the value of one fish and a lot of people just discard them instead of like reeling them in over time it adds up so you really do benefit from just reeling those in oh that sucks I'm going to go turn in the ones I have and see where I'm at as far as, um, like, getting quests quest done. Quest is, yes, hi, I English very well. Well done. I hope Storvald chokes on his ale when he hears the news. Of Excellent work. Okay, so that completed one of my legacy quests. Um, I'm pretty certain. Yeah, it's still leaving me with defeat enemies. I'm at 77%. Um, very nice. Congrats on that. And I still have some heroics to do. But we'll get there. Let's see where we're at with these keys. So see, I can already make one arcane and one storm giants. 
Gonna have to do some fishing. Maybe we'll go out and see what's going on at the fishing frenzy. Somebody's actually legit out there. But they just started it. Yep, they're fishing. Nice. <clears throat> I actually enjoy fishing. Um, spent many a weekend sitting here fishing when this mod first came out. So see, this is just a crappy little one fish, but like I said, that adds up. Um, they're also faster to, dang it, they're also faster to reel in. Stupid turtle. Oh dang it, I didn't even see I had a fish on my on my hook. Just daydreaming. Um, probably not, but honestly, I'm just after the fish, because that's more keys. I feel like this fishing needs some music. What do you think? I don't know what the plays, but the fishy on me. Got a lot to be, but the fishy on me. Got a new, I'll slap your knee. Fishy on me, fishy on me. I don't know what the plays, but the fishy on me. Got a lot to be, but I'll slap your knee. Fishy to be, but I don't know ye. Fishy on me, it's a fishy to be. See, look at this. I get nothing but, like, ones. Okay. See, you have to have fish and music. Hello, motherfucker. Well, hello to you, too. Oh, 
Oh, I got it too! Watch, this stupid turtle is gonna bump me. Nope, it bumps her black. Another one. Level two fishy. Turtle breath. He doesn't care about dental care. Yep, definitely not gonna happen. 409? Mm -mm. That's okay, we caught some fish. Those are keys. We'll see what the next one is that pops up. I'm probably gonna have to go turn these fish in real quick. mean to click on the person. Well, that's not quite enough for a key, but we're getting there.
Ancient Mariner. Okay, that one's right over here. So we'll go do this heroic. Um, gonna take a two second break. Gonna go grab some water. Be right back. Okie doke, I'm back. Sorry about that, y'all. Had to go get some water and grab my charger because my phone is like extremely old and has the worst battery in the world. So, let's see, where were we? Alright, we need to do Ancient Mariner or Mariner, however you say it. I'm going to say Mariner. Hi, Far Cry. Welcome in. Y 
you could hear combat when I had it on the B rack be right back screen okay I'll have to look into that um, I might have put the um, game sounds in the background late streams is kind of a new program to me when I initially started off streaming I was using uh, Streamlabs OBS um, but because my computer is also a piece of crap um, it just it didn't work so well just like uh, trying to stream Oh boys. Um, so, uh, Analia introduced me to Lightstream, and it's really nice. Like, everything flows very easily. The program is super easy to set up. Um, and last night they gave us, like, um, the authorization to basically add in more programs, which is really, really nice. I like that your stunt doubles come down to like help me out. Nice. Thank you, Rubix. <laughs> Looks like landing party is back up again, so up we go. Hi, Swath Bark. Welcome in. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah, when I added in the mega fart, my husband was like, Really? I'm like, Yeah. Really? Like, have you not met me? Come on, I'm extremely immature. <laughs> Try harder like you mean it. <laughs> That's hilarious. Don't push too hard, Rubik's. You know, you might end up with something you ain't asking for. Ah, <laughs> uh, come on, you jerk face. with this guy? Is he stuck down there? Oh, okay. There he is. Come on, Biggin. Come on down here. Oh, tasty. blessing. Let's see where we're at. <clears throat> okay, we need one epic heroic. And it looks like we've completed these other two. 
So that will be the end of that. Uh, it looks like raiding party is going to be where we're going. I was kind of hoping for the turtle, but you know. I'm going to call it out in zone uh, just to let other people know that we are going to do this raiding party just in case there's people hanging around waiting for someone to start the epic. There's only one instance. That's good. Dang it, I can't spell today. Starting raiding party. Yeah, I think it's in an hour. Uh, let me look at my world clock. Yeah, it's 5.55 LA time, so in an hour and five minutes. Dude, how are you going to throw a rock at your bear? That wasn't very nice. Like, what? Fuck you, man. I'm like standing here trying to protect you. That's how you do me. Yeah, estimated downtime is four hours. We'll see. Might go out and do a little bit of gardening this morning. I just planted a uh, avocado tree. So I'm gonna go check on it, see how it's doing. I think next I'd like to plant a lemon tree. Yeah, are you gonna stream some marbles? I will definitely come play some marbles. Guys, if you have not checked out uh, Marbles on stream yet, I seriously like, recommend you check out a Cube. Um, see, that's what he streams his Marbles on stream, and it is so fun. Um, I play with him when he plays at night. 
Um, what is it? Monday, Wednesday, and Friday that you stream aerobics? Thank you for the sub. Much love. Much love. And the weekend, yep. Um, my family and I, that's become like our family game night. We all subscribe to a Rubik's. Um, and so on the weekends when he's subscribing, it's it's a good way for like the family to bond and have fun and, you know, a little competition, healthy. How you like that hot little Lego that popped up? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh yeah, I definitely want to do that too. Um, probably when I get my new computer, because mm -hmm, this one I have now is just absolute shit. It's it's so slow. But I mean, to be fair, it is 10 years old. Um, <clears throat> it's just it's a dinosaur. I'm pretty sure like Jesus and his friends got together and made my computer. Yep. Well, there's less than 10 now. Uh, I think you make my fourth subscriber. So I've got six spaces left. And Aaliyah was my first. Pop my subscriber cherry. This guy. What a dickhead. Like, come on, buddy. Just take it. What did he do? Bring in some friends? That's not fair. Yeah, he did. Ugh. I'm gonna pull him away from those guys. for that. Well done. Okie doke. So, that should have completed all three of my legacy quests. Gonna turn those into Protector's Enclave. Ooh, Kill Bill. Love that movie. What? Where'd you come from?
Thank you, Dwarf, for those bits and the amazing tunage. Now we're going to go turn these legacy quests back in. Um, and if you really wanted to maximize the Storm King's Thunder, when you Each talk to Sybil, you can come down here tell me and change your and bonus to, to Storm the King's Thunder as well. And then you would get a little bit additional. Um, I do currently have mine set to Sharandar just because we do also have a double Sharandar event going on. And with the new mod coming today, um, those that currency will be able to be converted into the new currency from my understanding. So, yeah, wanted to maximize that the most I could. So I'm going to go ahead and turn these quests in. Um, and as you can see, this is basically doubled. So I'm getting 10 secrets of Astoria. 10 towns, um, 10, 10 town supplies, 10 runic pieces, the Vaughn and Blood, and then the bonus campaign currency at the bottom. That's going to be for the Sharndar. So let's delete that one. Delete this one. And we'll complete this one. I always stack all three of those whenever there's like a double coming up. Um, it's just something that I've always done because. Neverwinter is really nice to us, and they do kind of rotate these through. Um, so it's definitely worth holding on to those legacy quests <clears throat> until there's a double currency event for whichever particular ones that you're working on. Um, and then once you've done them, you can come into the store. You can pick up all kinds of things to help you with leveling up your character or leveling up your companion. Um, I've personally never gotten this one before, but usually I'll... Well, I used to do the companion upgrade tokens. All my companions are fully maxed out now. Um, so these would be worth getting. But just keep in mind they are going to be bound to your account. So you cannot sell them. And let's see where that put us. As far as keys are concerned. Uh, not great. But I'm able to make one of each. Um, these are the Fangbreaker ones, which is definitely worth having. Um, and as you can see, I now have plenty of Fawn and Blood and the supplies to make them. Um, each one takes, what was it, 200? No, 2,000 Vaughn and Blood. I've got 7,000 Vaughn and Blood from doing that. Um, and honestly... I would go back and do some more fishing just to maximize it um, during this double event. Um, but I'm not going to bore you guys with sitting there watching me do more fishing. And then, as you can see, I'm already starting to stack these other ones. I've got two Ravenloft. Um, that's not something that they give us. Yeah, we do get a double Barovia or Ravenloft. Um, so yeah, any of these you want to like hold on to them until you get all three, and then sit and wait until there's a double 
currency event for those particular so that you can maximize what you're making. I mean... <laughs> I try not to. Looks like everyone's getting ready for the shutdown of the game. You can always tell this because there's just people standing around in the enclave. Again with the mega fart, really. Nice Rubik. Naughty. <laughs> <clears throat> oh yes, my polar bear cub sold. Very nice. Yep, you're excused. Oh, yeah, I'm sure it will. All right, you guys, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the stream for now. Um, we will be back after the um, server comes back up. And Ali and I will be doing a um, stream together showing the new content. She's got some amazing stuff to give away. So please be sure to come and check us out. Um, have some fun. Have some laughs. And thank you to everyone that dropped in today and viewed the stream. Um, thank you to the subs and the bits and all the love. You guys have an amazing day and we'll see you in a few hours.